What's up, family? What's up, Marcus gang? Whatever you want to be called. But anyways, we is back with another video. And judging by the title, y'all probably like, that really did happen. Yeah, that did happen. And I'm about to tell y'all all about it. But anyways, let's get straight into the video. But before we get straight into the video, let me just say something. This is the second time of me filming this story time now i think i'm gonna break it up into three parts because i want to tell every detail for every detail what happened what actually happened and everything like that without being rushed now the first time i tried to film the story time it was 20 minutes long and that was only for part one but see what happened was that it ended up taking too long to process on youtube at first, I thought, yeah, it's going to take longer than usual because it's a longer video than my other videos, obviously, right? So, it uploaded, and then when it was processing, mind you, I uploaded this video, like, around 7 p.m. at night yesterday. It, and when I woke up this morning, it still said processing, so I was like, you know what? Let me just cut it shorter so it can be for a faster upload, which is why also this video is going to be broken up into three parts and not only just the three parts so I can explain everything word for word, detail for detail for detail. But anyways, it is 8.06 and I got to get out here at 8.15 and without further ado, let's get straight into the video. <music> So, this is, okay, so we're going to bring it back, like, a week before the actual week of prom. So, I mean, not prom, homecoming. So, um, so, you know, you everybody already know, the week before homecoming or a special event, especially like a dance or something, everybody try to find their outfits, they, who they going with. Uh, see if they can get extra money to buy the tickets. Um, you know, it, just a whole lot, a lot, a lot, a whole lot of extra stuff that just, just, there's just so much stuff that you just gotta get done before the homecoming. So that was me. That was me and my friends. We was scrambling around trying to figure out, okay, who we going with, uh, what we gonna wear, what colors. Uh, is you buying the prompt? Like, who buying everything? Like, who? Like, who, why? What we gonna do? So, oh, so as an overall picture, I got um two of my friends asked me, can I go to prom? Go to prom with them? Not prom. Homecoming. If I keep on saying prom, it's gonna be a problem. But two of my friends asked me, can I go to homecoming with them? At first. I didn't really want it to go to homecoming because me, as y if y'all know me, I really don't do school events, school special stuff for school. I really don't do that stuff. Me, I'm a stay at home person. If I, if um they say, shoot, my weekend is my weekend. My weekend ain't finna be spent at no school, especially at no dance. That's just me. I don't know about y'all, but that is just me. Me, I originally did not want it to go. Um, I wanted to stay in the house. I just wanted to pick up on extra hours at my work. And that was it. But ultimately, I got dragged into school. So, basically, um, so at this point, I'm going with two of my friends. We're going to call the two of them. We're going to call one of them Dora. And we're going to call the other one, uh, uh, Ruby. <laughs> yeah, Ruby. So, I was going with two of my friends, Dora and Ruby. So... We are uh, like was saying, okay, what you gonna wear? What colors we need to wear? And all that stuff like that. So originally, Dora, I think she said that she um didn't she didn't know if she really wanted to go like that. So all I know is that I wanted to go. Finally, I wanted to go, and Ruby wanted to go. So we ended up going to the mall. Okay, no, no, no. Before we went to the mall. Dora, she, she, she eventually wanted to go. So then, basically, I had to buy me and my sister's ticket because my sister at the time, she didn't have no job. So, and plus, she wanted to go, too. So, I had to buy her ticket and my ticket. So then, after we got all our tickets situated and everything like that, we decided to go to the mall or whatnot. I went to the mall with Ruby. So, I went to the mall with, mall with Ruby and stuff. So... We was 
Okay. Okay, this names this name stuff I just can't do it. I went to the mall with Ruth. So we went so once I went to the mall with Ruth, we was like, oh, what we gonna wear and stuff like that, yada 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 yada. So then we ended up going to a local grapevine. We went to going there to go find our um pr not prom, our homecoming outfits. So once we found our homecoming outfits, it was real cool. We wanted to stay away from colors like red and black, the typical gold and black. We wanted to stay away from like just black in general. We just we didn't want any black, but you all know those was the colors we picked. We ended up picking red and black, but it was cute though because I had this like uh formal fitted uh button down burgundy Michael Kors shirt and with black slacks and also with um with a little ice on my wrist. It was all it was all cute. It was all cute or whatever. So that's what I ended up wear, wearing. Ruth she ended up wearing this um burgundy and burgundy I think with a little bit of gold and black up in there. So we so it so we complimented each other because my uh watch was gold. It had like gold accents on it, so it was real cute. So we ended up finding our outfits or whatever. We like, yeah, we finna get a prime, we finna turn up, we finna uh whoop wop wop and all that stuff. So then after um we find our outfits and stuff like that. So then now it's the week of prom. Um, if I keep on saying prom, homecoming. It's the week of homecoming. Homecoming. Monday, normal. People talking about homecoming, how they gonna be popping out and stuff. You know the you know the typical high school students that be saying, Oh, we're gonna pop out, we're gonna do all that stuff. Everybody was just saying they're gonna show out, they're gonna show up and everything like that. There was we was all discussing what do y'all wanna do after homecoming. Uh supposedly there was supposed to be an after party that everybody wanted to go to. But I ended up not going to it, and I'll tell you why. Um, after party, people was like, oh, we finna eat this, we finna eat that before, oh, we finna do this on the day of. It was just a whole lot of, lot of a whole bunch of stuff. People were saying we finna sleep in hotels. It was just a whole bunch of stuff. Everybody was just saying what they finna do and stuff like that. So previous, before the whole coming day, that week kind of just felt weird. It just felt awkward like it didn't feel normal everything was just kind of like on edge it was just so weird and then on top of that it, we was just i don't know like people it was just mixed emotions like i was like i don't think i should go girl i don't think i should go but i think i should already go because i don't already brought the ticket and then on top of that i don't already brought the clothes that i was gonna wear to it so it would have been a waste of money not to go and I had already brought the clothes, the ticket, and everything like that. So, basically, I was already sad. So, then, when Friday come, now, this is when it all come down. But, y'all gonna have to find that out in part two. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you are new. And I will see you guys in part two. If y'all want a part two, please comment in the comment section below. Hashtag Marcus Day. Hashtag Marcus Day. Hashtag Marcus Day. Part 2. Hashtag Marcus Gay. Part 2. Comment that all below in the, in the section. In the comment section below. But until further ado, please like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in part 2. If y'all want part 2. Bye.